Hey there, Dan at DanLiberto.com, where we are improving influence and reaching a greater potential. And uh, procrastination. How many of us out there procrastinate? That's what I want to talk about tonight. Procrastination. We all struggle with it. Procrastination bug. And so, uh, you know, there's many of us, we have things we want to get done. And at the end of most days, we look around and we say, my gosh, I didn't get that done. That's, that's the main thing I wanted to get done today, and I didn't get it done. What, what happened? Well, every time you thought about it throughout the day, you decided to push that can a little bit farther down, kick that can a little bit farther down the road. So you procrastinated. The time wasn't right. The feelings weren't right. The temperature wasn't exactly right. So at any rate, uh, you didn't get it done. So we all procrastinate. So how do you overcome procrastination? Well, it all starts with, well, I'm going to share with you three things. The first one I'm going to share with you is, I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. You ready? You got to establish goals. <laughs> there it is. You got to establish goals. You, you, you have to have priorities in your life and understand what those priorities are. And you have to understand the why behind the priorities. Because if you if your why isn't big enough, um, then what's going to happen is when the procrastination bug shows up, your, your why has got to be bigger than that procrastination. Your why has got to be bigger than that obstacle that stands between you and what you need to be doing. And so set goals. Uh, you know, if you, I heard it said, and this was a great way of saying it, if you started the, uh, the, the motors of, of, a, of a ship and then you just kind of accelerated it and started it going forward with no, with no captain, with, with nothing, and just let it go, where would that boat end up? Well, that's the thing. We don't know. We don't know where it would end up. It would be subjected to the winds and to the uh, waves and to the current and all those different things. And that's what that's the way many of us spend our lives. And that's what it's like when we don't have goals set up. If we don't have priorities, if we don't know where we're going. If we don't have a captain of our own ship, that's what happens. And so you have to have those priorities. And I said a minute ago that your 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 goals, they have to be bigger than your obstacles. And so the second thing I'll tell you is when you're setting those goals, plan big to win big. Don't be afraid to dream. You know, we in our lives today, we are, dreaming has become almost a bad thing. You know, our imaginations. We are created with these wonderful imaginations and that's one of the things we have over the animals. So why not use it? Dream big, plan big, to win big on your goals. Really kind of set the, set the bar out there and challenge yourself a little bit. If you're not challenging yourself, if there's no pain associated with what you're doing, then no wonder procrastination comes because you don't really see the, the need. You don't really see the, the, the interest. You don't see the benefit. So that's the second thing I will say is plan big to win big. And then the last thing I will say is create habits. And here's why I say that. You know, I, I start off with set. I start off talking about setting goals, but in reality, what we want to do, we don't want to just set goals. I did that for many years. I set goals, and they were out there. Do you have goals? I got goals, but I really, I really didn't have any habits that would assure that I would achieve those goals. And so, life really gets easier when you create successful, winning habits that take you in the direction of your of your goals and of your big dreams because when you set habits you're on autopilot things just happen it's automated you don't even know you're doing it and you're moving in the right direction how cool is that so that's what i would say you want to you want to cut down on the procrastination set goals for yourself set priorities plan big to win big and then create winning successful habits if i can help you with any of those feel free to personal message me right now and or, or just put a post on my Facebook page. Let me know what you got out of this. I'd love to get your take on it. And if, if, if you know somebody that will, benef that will benefit from this message, feel free to share. And as always, I appreciate it if you'd like my page. Dan at DanLiberto.com. Till the next time, we're talking. Take care. Bye now.